this is the tailings piles, and then up over there is the wall face. Got a couple options today. As you can see, people have been working it pretty good. Okay, so we've decided on a spot up here. This is just over the hill at the very top. They said the good diggings were, uh, are you gonna find the bigger crystals just uh, right in the dirt instead of down on the, the wall face? Uh, we might head down there a little bit later, but for now this is kind of what we're used to from Canada. This actually reminds us of a, a place, Torrey Hill, back at home. So we're kind of familiar with the process here. But, so we've got a sifter. And I've just been digging in here in the tree roots, hoping to find an open pocket, but nothing yet. Just uh, a lot of loose rock, but the tree roots do grab stuff. And if you see here, there's one. Really nice. That is what we came for. Mind you, bigger would be nice, but for now, that works. I'm going to try and get it in the sun here. Let's look at this one. But nice sort of focus. There's Alicia working her pocket or her section. There we go. All right. Small, but. So pretty. Yeah. This is what we found so far. There's a couple. So we're in a little mini cavern here, and I just stumbled across a bit of a pocket. And out of that came this.
was a good one. Oh, I didn't even see that one. And that one. These are some of the smaller crystals we found. I put them in muriatic acid to try and get rid of some of the little calcite bits and some of the iron staining. And if that doesn't work, I might try some super iron out. But
So here are a few highlights of the ones on Matrix. First of all, this Druzy is amazing. I think this was the top of a pocket. No big crystals, but... Wow. Not cleaned yet. This one is neat. So what's really neat about this material is all the bugs. Now you can look at this rock and this is just a, one that I've been chipping away and it doesn't appear to be much, but when I split it open, that's what came out. Wow. This one here is still not clean, but if you can see, there's a ring of calcite there. And this has some crystal faces that I can see. But, it was broken when I picked it up. It doesn't run too deep. I'm thinking what I'm going to do is, I might put this in muriatic acid. Dissolve out this calcite, and maybe with some big crystals will pop out of it. Well, let's try it. Still bubbling away a little bit, but I wanted to have a look at it here. Oh, 
that in the big crystal. So there's just one last one that I wanted to show you. It's actually loaded with crystals all the way through it. I don't know if you can see. 